President Muhammadu Buhari of Nigeria has met behind closed door with the Speaker, House of Representatives, Femi Bajabia Mila, at the presidential villa Abuja to discuss on issues affecting the country. The meeting is part of the ongoing strategic engagement of the president with relevant stakeholders aimed at finding solutions to the nation's security and socio-economic challenges. Speaking at the end of the meeting with the president, the speaker re-emphasized the commitment of the National Assembly to continue to assist President Buhari as he put in more effort to find a lasting solution to the present security challenges confronting the nation. He explained that his discussion with the president centered on security and other matters related to the development of the country. We will always speak about security because that's the number one. We will speak about the security situation, we will speak about the economy, we will speak about the politics of it all. And, um, and, um, and um, we have always at least, uh, he has a listening ear, and we profile ideas, you know, he tells us his own views. And um, we come to some consensus one way or the other. The speaker revealed that the House of Representatives had since set up a special committee that would offer a solution to the nation's security problems. The House of Representatives some time ago passed the resolution and we set up an adult committee, a special adult committee which is headed by, which involves all principal officers. Uh, and, um, and uh, 30 other members of the House. And we're going to start that process into looking at uh, um, uh, 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 different solutions and we'll be bringing the report to Mr. President. He's fully aware of it and he's open to anything and everything and that will help us in, um, in, in, um, in coming to a, uh, uh, a resolution in this matter. There is concern by government officials, security experts and ordinary Nigerians that the ongoing attacks on security agencies in the southeast and south-south, which appeared to be coordinated, is getting worse. In Imo State, Nigeria's southeast gunmen suspected to be IPOB members attacked and set ablaze the country home of the state governor, Ope Usodima. Nigeria has been fighting Boko Haram insurgency, banditry, kidnapping and violent uprising by the IPOB secessionists. Kamal Sadiq, reporting for CBA TV, Nigeria.